Hello YouTube, welcome back to another episode of the lucrative adventures of the Storeman Jojo. I am the Storeman, but I'm not Jojo. <laughs> for August, let's see, for the week of uh, July 29th, 2018. Let's get into it here. Let me tell you what the picks are for this week. These are the things that I picked this week. I got these from uh, Facebook Marketplace. A guy was selling uh, these models and uh, I was able to get them for a dollar a piece so I paid five dollars for these five models uh, I got this Game Boy at a yard sale uh, it was just a pretty decent deal I got five dollars had some games with it that one worked out real well I got this at the Goodwill because the yard sales were so bad the Goodwill was half off this last Saturday so on Saturday, so uh, I went ahead and got this. Uh, this is for a uh, car, a stock car radio. I paid four dollars for it. Uh, this is a belt buckle. This is for the gun enthusiasts. Uh, it looks like a revolver, you know, bullets in a revolver. Uh, I picked that up because I thought, you know, there's some gun crazy guy out there that would want this. I paid a dollar for it. This is neat. Blast from the past. Atari 2600 game. You know, still in the box. Um, has the, all the instructions with it and stuff. That was a neat little find. I paid a dollar for that. That was at a, a state sale run by the family of the guy and not like an estate company because when the state companies do it, they look everything up and they know how much everything's worth and they, uh, they, you gotta pay. You gotta pay a full price, almost retail. That was it for yard sales, and that was it for picking. This right here is uh, all the sales that I had this week. Sold this Game Boy. This was not in great shape. Uh, I paid five dollars for it, and I got nineteen ninety nine for it. Uh, that's what I grossed on that. Um, that was, I guess, pretty decent because it wasn't in great shape. It's ugly. Got this Pokemon game for two dollars and fifty cents at a yard sale. I sold that for $15.99. I got this uh, Dave Ramsey, uh, let's hear, participant guide or participant kit for a uh, financial piece uh, university. These are always good sellers if you can find them. Uh, I paid $5 for it and I sold it for $55. Um, this is really neat. I got this from a uh, yard sale. These are a bunch of old Transformers from McDonald's, from McDonald's Happy Meals. I uh, paid two fifty for them all, and I was able to get twenty nine ninety nine for them. That was pretty good. Flip. Here's a pair of skate Kate Spade glasses. Paid three dollars for them. I was able to get twenty three seventy four for them. That was a really good flip. Got this uh, another Pokemon game, the Crystal version, for Game Boy, and uh, paid two fifty for it, and I was able to get twenty six ninety nine for that one. This is a, uh, a vacuum sealer for food, uh, still in the box. I paid three dollars for it, and I was able to sell that for thirty-four dollars. Here is a uh, bunch of uh, Disney movies. I like to get Disney movies at yard sales, and you know, pay a few bucks for them, and then when I get a good group of them, I'll sell them all. And I paid eight dollars altogether for all of these, and I sold those for twenty-nine ninety-nine. Um, I got this, uh, I think this is a Gar Magellan, okay, this is a Magellan, uh, GPS for hiking and, uh, boating, and I paid a dollar for that, and I was able to get $39.99 for it. Here are some old Transformers that I picked up at a yard sale, these are from the early 90s, I paid two fifty dollars for them, and I was able to get $29.99 for those. And here's that, ex that same Game Boy that I bought this past week. I was able to sell it this week also. Uh, I paid five dollars for it and ended up selling that for sixty dollars. So it was a pretty decent week this week. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I'm glad you clicked on my video. And I'm, 
And if you would, if you'd like and subscribe. Um, I only say that because that's what everybody says at the end of these. So I'm just trying to be like everybody else. But uh, there's lots of money to be made out there. You know, go, go and learn this stuff. Watch videos online. You don't have to watch mine. You know, mine aren't all that great. But uh, there's lots of videos online that show you what to buy. That's the way I learned. And I learned a lot through trial and error. So uh, just go out there and learn the business. It's a fun little hobby. You make a little extra spending money. And uh, it's fun. So I'll see you next week with another episode. Have a nice week.